Today on Animal Fact Files, we're discussing the giant freshwater pufferfish. This animal has many common names, including the giant puffer and the umbu pufferfish. The giant part of its name is in reference to this animal's size. These fish can reach over two feet long as adults and are considered the largest living freshwater pufferfish alive today. Obviously, the freshwater part of their name comes from where they live. Giant pufferfish live in lakes, rivers, and other freshwater systems of Africa from the Congo Basin and surrounding areas. While their name doesn't hint at this fact, these fish can also be found in brackish water estuaries along the African coast. They're demersal fish, which means they spend most of their time near the bottom of the water column, and they prefer water temperatures between 75 and 79 degrees Fahrenheit. The name Mbu or Mabu is African in origin and means something like rock. Can you tell why? Giant puffers have a rock-like pattern across their backs. This blotchy patchwork is essential for blending in among the rocks along the bottom of their habitat. With their broken up outline, they all but disappear. Unfortunately, their camouflage doesn't protect them from habitat destruction, which threatens some of their populations. Giant freshwater pufferfish are classified in the swellfish genus, referring to their ability to swell up, similar to the common name pufferfish. This genus name means four teeth and refers to their beak-like mouth made of four fused teeth. Giant pufferfish use these tough chompers for breaking apart the hard shells of crustaceans, mollusks, and more. As they eat, their teeth are sharpened and worn down keeping them ready for use at all times. If they didn't eat hard-shelled animals, their teeth could overgrow to the point of losing the ability to eat. These pufferfish have no scales and can be told apart from other members of their genus by the lack of certain bones in their head. They're still bony fish, however, and have a skeleton. Giant puffers are pale along their belly with dark patterns along the top part of their body. When they're sick, or even if they're in a poor mood, they can develop dark splotches along their stomach as well, though healthy individuals don't have these. A giant puffer's tail is yellow and can be folded or on full display while they swim. Like other pufferfish, giant freshwater pufferfish are poisonous to consume. Their skin and organs are toxic. Very little is known about this species' breeding habits. Other members of their genus nest in the substrate and one or both of the parents stick around to protect the eggs until they hatch about a week later. Giant pufferfish are known to grow rapidly and they can survive more than a decade. For more facts on giant freshwater pufferfish, check out the links below. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today. Thank you to our patrons, Spikesfield93, Dad, and everyone else for their support of this channel. And thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.